Get your favorite coloring, crayons, pencils, or markers and come into your favorite spot with the coloring sheet for window four, the realist. Because today you are going to color your way to mastering this energy. So how we do this is we color and by coloring we open and unlock that right holographic brain so that the symbolic imagery or the light language held within the card can truly see the intention of what this window is connecting you to. So as we explore and begin to color, grab whatever color is calling to you now. A lot of times you can do your own color analysis, but you could also color with red or yellow as we're gonna be working on root and solar plexus chakra today. So whatever feels right, go ahead and begin. Start at the area of the card that is calling to you most right now. So if you look at the top right hand corner, you're gonna see the sun. The sun uh, represents the solar plexus chakra and when it touches the top right hand corner, we're looking at the physical aspect of that solar plexus chakra, which is the human. It is you, your human journey. Sometimes we call this the ego. I like to call it the low self journey. There's everything perfect and divine about this. It's just that it's representative of the human paradigm. And then when you look at the left-hand side of the card, you'll see the tree anchoring there. This is representative of the root chakra. And when touching the left-hand side of the card, it embodies the emotional energy of that chakra, which is grounding. And so this realist energy, window four, is truly about evoking the mastery of grounding or becoming present in your human reality, right? And so there are some things that we avoid doing or sometimes there are things um, that we resist doing because we are so focused somewhere else or we're in our mind and we're avoiding what the actual reality is showing up as. And so this master energy is a reminder that it's important to stay connected to the human paradigm and that even the most mundane and little tasks can bring not only reward for your human body and what you're building, but also bring in the validation or just get you away from the funnel or the tunnel that you were thinking through to help you expand or have a new experience that can bring in more awareness. And so this is a really primal, very grounded energy. It shows up as one of the first within our window sequence, right? So because it's an emotional expression of the root chakra, it's going to show up early on in the number scale for our windows. Um, so it's all about being really present in life. And then when you're present and you're connected to what's going on around you in your reality, in the physical paradigm, you can begin mastering this realist energy window four. So if you take a look at the card, um, you'll see down at the right hand corner, there is a person there um, with a very interesting symbol in the middle of the belly um, and kind of some squiggly lines coming down out of the ears. And it's really interesting. Uh, the intention or the, the meaning of this can be so multifaceted and however you want to interpret. Um, but truly, it's about really getting down into a primal awareness. And um, instead of keeping things above the head and you can see the person's arms are extended out right as if they're creating a level or a separation between the body everything below the arms and the head and so truly this is about how often humans get in their head or get so tunnel visioned with what they're doing um, that they forget about what they need those instincts and so we start forgetting to listen to our body um, and numbing some of those feelings or those urges that are coming up in our physical reality and 
uh, a lot of times those urges, um, those instincts are going to guide you to the next step that you need to unfold or unpackage whatever it is that you're working on. And so we need to trust in how our physical reality is uh, working through us. And so if you can see down around the big engorged belly, there are ears. So it's about listening to that body, listening to things below the head. Um, and, and then you get an axis there that has the world um, and the moon kind of, and what could also be represented as the sun. It's about really anchoring, um, anchoring the world inside of you, the human, right? And it's about listening to, again, it's on an axis, it's spinning. It's about listening to the subtle shifts and changes. You know, there's a circadian rhythm that is is um, anchored to our human paradigm of time and as a human collective we all decide that when it's night we sleep and when it's morning we wake up and at certain times we're transitioning through eating so these are very instinctual ingrained things within us and it's this energy and when you work with this master energy get ready to start to unlock some of those primal instincts urges and things that maybe you you have um, numbed or turned the volume down on. And so we're going to rev that volume up and become really connected to the physical reality again. And we're going to become realistic and start to only do and, um, and move and work with what is within our field. Again, not, not going too far into non-physical, not getting too far into your mind, but really just starting to interact with what What's here now and this is a segment right we're pulling one of 77 aspects of our multi-dimensional self out to work on here so this isn't forever but it is for right now we want to get retuned in to the body and retuned in to the timeline of earth and how earth is spinning and how earth is communicating with us and what this specific timeline is trying to teach us and so as you continue to color enjoy Enjoy finding some of the words again right above the head you'll see a big L that goes right from the top of the head and touches the Sun so that's the L in the world realist um, and so you can just begin to play with and explore some of the other symbolic meanings or images here and know that as you continue to color you are unlocking the master energy of the realist within you and so look for those invites by your reality to get more grounded and present with what's happening today with so much light and love this is where i leave you